immigration questions asked to um, senior citizens or uh, those who like my relatives those who came from uh, india to canada to visit me and uh, they came on Toronto Pearson International Airport. So I'm going to describe the immigration questions were asked to the to them and uh, the answers they provided. OK, so the difficulty they had, they had knowledge of very little English. So uh, they were even stranded at the Kisok because they were not able to operate it, but they got some help after uh, some time. So that's OK. So the, so the questions that were mainly asked to them First is purpose. Why are you coming in? Second question they asked if they had a return ticket. They showed they did have. Then uh, they asked like uh, where are they going? So they had my address printed. They showed that also. Then they said uh, because my relatives had earlier uh, travel history to Canada and they did not breach any rules. So that's why officers were not like too harsh on questions. Then they asked uh, if any prohibited item was being brought in and they said no. Of course, that conversation was not as simple as I'm saying, but these were the questions that were asked. And then finally uh, he asked, OK, so uh, you have return ticket and all and, and you know that you cannot stay for more than six months without filing extension. My parents said yes. OK, and then they were allowed to. Now these questions vary case by case, but in my case, like uh, my um, relatives, they had travel history before where they stayed here, filed extension, and then they went and did not breach any condition of visitor visa. So probably that's why it was not too harsh on them. So that's what it is, guys. So thanks for watching this video, guys. Please subscribe to the channel. I hope this is going to help.